afternoon, good evening, whenever you're watching this. Um, good morning, it's your girl Lala G. And I'm gonna be quiet because the kids are still sleeping. But I am up and at it. Skincare routine is done. If you don't know, I am pregnant 21 weeks and some change. And um, I switched up my skin routine um, and I started using Luxwell products and Ambi skincare products. So, and I had to switch up my routine and I'm really loving it. I make sure I stay very consistent with my skincare routine just because, um, let me turn the TV down one second you guys so i switched up my skincare routine and i started using ambi's skincare plus my body scrubs and my rejuve that i have um if you guys are looking for body scrubs or rejuve for the face then you can click the link down below i am um i have my own wellness shop on etsy and it's mg wellness hey you guys so i am going to starbucks with sage I want to try the cold brew. Um, it's a Starbucks coffee drink. I am in the mood of a picker upper. Um, that is like my only way of kind of like getting away in my mind because I'm pregnant. If you did not know, I am currently 21 weeks. Okay, 21 weeks in like one day um, or 21 weeks in two days. 21 weeks in two days so um, the only thing that I can really indulge in is coffee here and there so I'm gonna go to Starbucks with my son Sage and we are gonna go get us a cold brew for the very first time um, I've been hearing some good things about it sorry if you hear the AC um, I've been hearing some good things about it so I really want to try um, and I hear that it's sweet and um not too sweet so i hear it's both um and that's what i like i don't like sweet coffee but i like coffee um but i like foam and stuff like that so we're gonna try it sage is probably gonna get him like a milkshake or something that they have i think they have like the um what is that called that white one it's like a milkshake so it's similar to a milkshake um yeah but i have a I have a Hustle Babe Academy meeting um, with my team, with some of the team. Um, some people have left already. Um, if you didn't know, I revamped and rebranded Hustle Babe Academy. So I no longer have BBH and HBA mentor, uh, mentorships. I now just have one mentorship, which is called Pretty Hustle Mentorship. Okay, dive into the Academy learning how to brand your business as a mompreneur um, super excited for that all of the information is down below if you're interested in joining um, I also have a um, a close friend list of course as you guys know um, and I'll be coaching in there as well um, so if you really can't you know tap into the pretty hustle mentorship you can always tap into close friends like said, all the information is coming down below I'm super excited to try this drink um, so yeah, the meeting starts at 5. It used to be BBH, like I said, it was Boss Babe Hustle, but now it's pretty, um, it's pretty simple. I'm just going to be mentoring the rest of the people that are in that mentorship. And then starting July 6th, I will be having the Pretty Hustle um, Zoom calls. So, so excited for that. So, so, so excited. So, almost to Starbucks and I will let you guys know if I like it or not. Do 
See, I've been thinking about you all the time. Racing through my mind, speeding like the autobahn. I've been searching everywhere, but the nigga up to now. I'm with your can make time even when I'm on the grind. I hold up. Now I just call you. Tone minus so the butter chicken got you dull. All my days, I be on the way. Go to Haji Mama, baby. Everything is gonna be okay, that's my lady. Tasha, they don't mind again. I yo, just call me money. We on different continents, you know that my code you said. Checking on my phone. Oh, you called again, can't on your phone call, you know I'm sick of playing games You could hide your feelings, but you know that I've been seeking yeah. that Could've just mattered, you're my baby, could get no more shit on that Now my father, I want you to only look at me high You been on my mind, drop me At the park, you guys In my, uh, I have a big old spot of clothes um in my room that i need to fold and then we're also going to look at a couple of um baby Ga baby gabriella's items we're going to look at a couple of we're going to look at a couple of baby gabriella's things um so i can show you guys what i've bought over the last couple of days so this morning i woke up i was feeling really good so i decided that i was going to tap into my podcast you guys it felt so good to be back on my podcast i have a new episode brand new season um i feel like i really didn't even start the podcast journey i started it and then i let so many things get in the way of me finishing what i started so it's kind of like the official comeback that really wasn't there but that's there you know what i'm saying uh, feels good to just be able to do everything from my bed so um, i really enjoy doing the podcast so what i decided is i'm going to sh um i'm gonna drop a podcast every um every wednesday so you guys get a, a morning podcast um, and that's what i love about podcasts you don't really have to do a lot of editing it's really raw unfiltered um or if you know if you don't have a podcast that's really raw and unfiltered then yeah you have to do a lot of editing but for me i have a show that is very raw and unfiltered i say what i want and some days may be really really good and then some days may be not so good you know um i don't have the I don't have the best grammar, so I think that used to stop me a lot um, before when I was uh, shooting for the podcast because my grammar was not, my grammar's still not that good. Um, but what I will say is, hey, that's what makes me me. I'm not perfect, and I'm not going to let that stop me from doing something that I want to do. Um, and on top of that, I'm not really, hold on. On top of that, I'm not really showing up for Instagram like that, so I really wanted to pick an outlet, or uh, I really wanted to pick a platform that I can consistently show up at and like be myself and not have to feel forced to like show all of these things or teach all of these things when I really don't want to. Um, my my mentorship is um, it's up and it's up and rolling. I don't have any mentees yet. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I'm kind of happy I don't because I'm still trying to prepare for um, you know baby girl and stuff like that. I'm in the middle of that, so I'm not really stressed out about having mentees. But what I really do love is that I have the mentorship. It's open. It's available. And then also we start our first session. Um, in July so July 6th so that gives me time that gives people time to join it gives people time to save if they want to save um, and I'm really in this season of pretty hustle I am really wanting to teach and coach those who are ready those who are not being forced or pushed to hustle I am a natural born hustler I can't help once I started the network marketing um, gigs like I just took off and I became this full-blown entrepreneur so I can't stop but what I can do is I can slow down and I can really coach those um, those mompreneurs that I really want to coach right I am tired of always feeling like I have to do something for the fucking brokies or for the cheap people or for the people who really don't who really don't want that hustle motivation like I shouldn't I shouldn't feel 
I guess I shouldn't feel forced to like show up for them. They have to feel forced themselves. They have to get that push a little bit from their self before I'm able to keep, you know, pushing them. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes, you know, being the coach that I am, it takes a lot of energy. If you guys don't know, like I have three kids. Y'all know this. Like for those who are new, hey girl, I have three kids and one on the way. Um, and for all of my, you know, all, all my loyal and, um, you know, returning subscribers, you know that I have the three boys and I have a busy life and already like with just having three boys and my husband my energy gets sucked so, so it's like, like I have to make room for like new energy and I'm in the season where new energy is definitely needed and I'm happy that I shut everything down and started all over again so pretty hustle mentorship is now available click the link down below join if you're a mompreneur because we are about to go high okay hi we're about to get some really good results um we're about to get paid we're about to get some knowledge and we definitely gonna get some motivation because i am the motivation queen okay when it comes to making this paper making this bag and making this cheddar from home with those kids no freaking freebies anymore like that's just what it is like i feel like i have been giving out so much information uh, for free um to so many people and i've just been taken advantage of so i just feel like in this season in this new season lala is just tapping into what she loves tapping into the people that tap into her um, and just keeping my mind clear and keeping my energy. That's, 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 that's the season I'm in. I want to keep my energy good. Um, like I said, when I was at the park, my energy already gets pulled from so different, from, from so many different people. Um, because I'm in a house of, um, I'm in a house with boys and, 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 and my husband who is a man. And so I'm already dealing with a lot of energies. So, um, I'm just like you know no freebies if you want to learn how to start a youtube channel if you want to learn how to start a podcast if you want to learn how to do this mompreneur uh thing then you need to tap into what i have and what i have is an amazing agency that is there to help you to guide you to motivate you and to get you the result and to get you the results that you're looking for um like I said, I didn't just wake up. Like, I think I've said this in a lot of videos, but I didn't just wake up like, oh, I'm a six-figure chick. You know what I mean? Um, I had to really build that confidence. And then once I got that confidence, I allowed um, social media to, like, make me feel some type of way. You know what I mean? And um, that's all my fault. That's no one's fault but uh, mine's. And now I'm like, no, girl, you got this. Like... Um, you have the sauce, you know, and if people want to learn from you, they're going to have to pay for your information, period. Um, and not even just paying for information. It's called pay to play nowadays. Like I told y'all, pay to play season is in full effect. Okay. Um, and I still think people were taking advantage of me after I came up with Hustle Babe Academy. So like I said, the new season, we not playing that. <laughs> We're not playing that. I'm sorry. If you're a friend of mine and you want to get some information on how to elevate, how to switch up your content, how to do your content, how to start a YouTube channel, how to start a blog, how to start a podcast, how to start whatever, you're going to have to pay me. Um, you can book a one-on-one -on -one, and that one-on-one -on -one can be on whatever you want it to be. But I have to have, I have to make, I have to have boundaries and... I'm learning that my boundary doesn't have to look like everyone else's boundaries, you know? So I don't just, I don't have to, I don't have to be like everyone else. I am me and I have to set the tone for me and what I have going on. I have three children. I'm expecting, like I was so involved in YouTube. I mean, not in YouTube, but I was so involved, so deeply involved in social media and helping people that I totally forgot about me. I forgot about what I have coming, the blessing that I have coming, which is my baby, baby rain. And I was just like, listen, la la, tap back into what you what you what makes you happy. Tap back into that. And if 
people don't follow you then they just don't follow you but i have a whole life you guys that is amazing and i don't get to talk about that a lot i'm always on here just kind of proving myself and then i go on social media and i'm always trying to prove myself prove myself and it's just like why am i doing this okay i really do get paid for my home i really did create seven streams of income i really am a six-figured boss why am i trying to beg people to join my mentorship or why am i trying to even if it didn't sound like i was trying to beg even if it sounded like or it looked like i was just truly giving out some good information to me deep down in my mind deep down in my heart i felt like i was begging and it's like no no no, no. we don't do that we don't beg <laughs> we don't do that and someone else told me that like we don't beg so i'm just truly living my true life right and bringing people on my real life journey and if you're trying to get down with the mompreneur gang, then, you know, go ahead and click that link down below. Get enrolled. Let's level up together. I can get you where I am. Pretty safe. I'm already leveled. I can go higher, but, you know, people in higher positions can only take you higher. You know what I'm saying? So if you're in a position where you're feeling like a low vibration of motivation, a low vibration of mompreneur... Uh, hustle then yeah joining the pretty hustle is going we're going we're going to get you there um so for me it's like i have to join other wealthy successful people so that i can get to that place and then of course you guys all of my mentees that are with me are going to go with me you know you you two are going to go with me always i'm never going to forget about you guys but i have to tap into my real life and stop trying to show so much okay i am one person a one person show and um i did a lot of this by myself and i'm very proud so i'm gonna finish these clothes and then we're gonna show you a little bit of gabriella stuff oh, these pants i can't even fit anymore i have to take some photos in these pants okay i remember when i took a photo in these pants i was like two and a half months three months now i'm six months you guys 21 weeks i'm six months and these and, are a size and you eight can't grab me. and i can't grab you because you're too big yeah oh my baby this is my baby liam my baby boy say hi what's your name liam liam that's mommy baby boy Yep, that's my only baby boy. I have my big boy, Sage, and I have my other big boy, Lathan, and then I have my baby boy, Liam Ace. And now I'm having a baby girl, Gabriella Ray. <laughs> <laughs> At the end of the vlog, what we got, Gabriella Rain. So let me show you guys what I got for baby Gabriella Rain. So I look crazy. I'm about to take my makeup off, you guys. Take my lashes and stuff off and get in my bed and take a nap. But I couldn't end this vlog out without showing you guys what we got for Baby Brain. So we have this cute little outfit. It says perfect. So cute. You guys, it has a little uh, headband and then it has the little ruffle bottoms. Super cute. So you got her that. And then we this also got her the sunflower cute. dress. And it has the little leggings. <laughs> it's so cute. This one doesn't have a bow, but I bought a lot of bows, you guys. So she does um, She does have a lot of bows. So I did put plastic bags so that just in case the boys want to come over here and touch her stuff, it stays like clean. Um, but we got her some more bows. So I love the bows. Like this one is like my favorite. Like where is she going with this little bow on? Um, but yeah, like she can wear... See, she can wear whatever type of bow with this outfit. But we did pick up these bins for baby Gab for baby Gabriella. So me and my husband, we did order her um, dresser. So she has a dresser, and then she also has a chair. Well, I have a chair that I'm going to be like breastfeeding her in, and you know all of that good stuff. So the chair and the dresser are going to go on this side, and then her bassinet is going to go by the bed. I'm buying all new linen. I'm buying all new pillows um, for for me and hubby and for the kids, so that um, we just have new uh, linen when the baby comes. The chair, it's and then like she's going to have like a, a small little organizer um, station or organizer spot where these will just slide in, and it keeps all of her clothes extra clothes um that i'm gonna have for her 
Um, and then I also have these bins right here. I know you guys have seen them when I believe it was my birthday or Mother's Day. But the boys got me um, these little baskets that say um, diapers and the other one says wipes. So these are the, all the diapers. I'm thinking I'm going to have like a, a, um, like a push like cart a um, next to the bed so that it's easy access to get the diapers, the wipes, and anything else that I need as far as like breastfeeding and changing baby. It smells so good. Like smell the diapers. Are you getting baby fever? Baby, baby, baby fever. Um... And yeah, so that's just a couple of things that I bought her. Just these two outfits that I added. I will give you guys like a full baby haul. Oh.